love thy neighbor as thyself. It's a very famous saying that goes with him. His life was an example, and even during the Last Supper, he washed the feet of his disciples to show how one should love each other the way the Lord loved us. Another great message of this was of forgiveness. He said that the best way to love was to give and forgive. And even when he was on the cross, his parting words were, we all remember, isn't it? Father, forgive for they do not know what they have done. They do not know what they have done. That was actually a very touching message at the cross. And he's made, and yet he can say that, Father, please forgive that, for they know not what they do. This is the ultimate forgiveness. Another important message of Lord Jesus was never to criticize, condemn, or judge other people. He said, don't look at the speck in other people's eye, but look at the beam in your own eye. An anecdote from the life of Jesus mentions when the crowd was, uh, this is a very interesting incident that happened. When Jesus comes, a lot of people will come and surround him. You know why I know all this? Because I know. I studied in middle school. This was one of the subjects. You know, religious, religious knowledge was one of the subjects. I didn't do very well, but I passed. <laughs> Okay, he said, don't look at the speck in other people's eyes, but look at the beam in your own eye. An anecdote from the life of Jesus mentions when the crowd was about to stone a fallen woman, he comes to her rescue and tells them, let the one who has not seen cast the stone first. What does that mean? Don't find fault. Each of you have got some sins behind you. So that's what he meant. Each of you who has not sinned, let him cast the first stone. So you see, very obvious that we find fault in others. So this is something that we must remember. We also got our own fault. So don't simply, they say, don't be judgmental. Do they? So, in these days, when the way of when the way of life has become that of greed and selfishness, Bhagavan Sri Satya Sai Baba came to teach us the eternal and universal human values. And we all know what are the five human values. So, brothers and sisters, today is the resurrection day where Jesus rose three days after he died. Well, no, no, they say that. So, after three days, he rose. Mm. And uh, of course, there were a lot of, you know, uh, gray areas, what happened to his body and all that, you know, we did not go into all that. We just believe that she goes from three days after the Okay? Yes. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you.